Hi guys, welcome to this quick video review about this Sailor 4-in-1 USB C to C hub. So it's a 4-in-1 C to C, something which is rather new in 2023. We don't see this a lot, so I wanted to test this and show you the results. So here you have the details. And so let's open the box and see what we get and then do some speed test and see if we get same reading as without the USB hub. So here's some description, but I mean it's a USB hub, so we don't have to look in detail into that. Makes a really good impression, looks really nice, I would say. Beautiful gray matte finish. Of course it's not flat, so it's maybe a little bit wobbly when you have it uh, on your desk but i mean it's a usb hub and so it's uh, stable with the cable anyway more or less so let's do some comparisons here i have my fastest usb c flash drive and you can see it has top of 145 and 51 read and write on usb 3.0 and so as a comparison, I've done a second test. You can see that here what I've done. This is a little bit a crazy configuration. I've been using the Sailor USB-C to USB-C hub here on the USB-C outlet and then connected also this very fast hub. It's a little bit crazy, something which you don't do normally, but I wanted to show you if there is some slowdown or so when we use these two times the USB-C to USB-C hub and you can see the result here. Uh, it's even faster than before for some reason. I mean, I had it on a USB 3.0 or even 3.1 very fast USB A outlet and here on this side we have this very complicated configuration and it's still faster than before so definitely indication that this is a very fast USB hub I mean it hasn't been running at full speed but it's still very fast my fastest USB stick so far and as you can see it was even faster than without the hub and so after first positive test i have mounted this usb hub here you can see it goes into my mini pc and i've connected my phone here that's the lg g5 and so you can see when I open the file explorer, I have it now attached with the open phone and you can see the G5 and I can click on that and use everything from here. So it works definitely super fast and this is one of the most important things because with a lot of USB hubs this connection hasn't been working. I had it here on this large USB A hub and it didn't work so I had to connect it directly into the USB C port but I have just one of them so I wanted to have more USB C ports and now I have more USB C ports thanks to this USB-C hub. Here I can show you that it also works for the GoPro. GoPro sometimes has some problems with USB hubs and in the first attempt I had also some problems but then I removed all the USB drivers, installed it again. I mean it's automatically, you just have to reconnect. You can see the cable goes here and into the hub and from the hub goes into the mini PC a little bit hard to see but it's definitely direct connection and so you can see the GoPro here on the left side I hope it's focusing more or less so I grab it here and move it on the right side to copy and I can say copy and replace and it will do that and no error message is shown and it's fully copied. So definitely full recommendation from my side and so you can buy directly here from Amazon and I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. Thanks for watching.